What are you I doing, you're McSteaming? <laughs> okay. Okay. You get to get all muddy. Are you gonna get muddy with us? Absolutely. No, <laughs> and later, Rabina sees the finished room for the first time. Are you excited? Yes. How excited? Very excited. Okay. <laughs> I got contacted by a few of these girls. They were telling me about their friend, Rubina, and they wanted me to help her transform the space. I was always just wondering where would I ever find the help that I need. So, so in came Barbara Kay. She was just like, I know what you want to do. Um, you want to start your own jewelry business. And she just went out of her way to make sure that I can pursue this creative outlet that I'm pursuing. So I'm just so excited. This is the back side of your other room. Oh. Hello. <laughs> well, we're gonna have to do something about this. We're gonna okay. have to put some drywall up, okay? Okay. Because you can't just have this, this tar paper. You Bond. don't want that. You can't okay. paint on it. So we're gonna have to put drywall up. It was really interesting for them to learn how a wall, I mean, what makes a house stand up? You guys ever done drywall? No. You're gonna love doing drywall. Really? Is it okay? You get to spackle stuff and just get all muddy. Really? Yeah. Are you gonna get muddy with us? Absolutely. No, I'm just kidding. We're all okay. gonna get muddy. Okay, perfect. Oh. Before we even got the drywall on, we had to measure how far apart the studs were to make sure that when we were screwing the drywall in, that they were going into the studs. You also need to mark where any outlets are. Here's a phone outlet, there's an electrical outlet over there. We're gonna cut out the drywall. And then the last thing we're gonna do is gonna screw it up. That might sound like a lot right now, but believe me, it's not. Rib. Rib. What are you doing, you McSteamy? <laughs> oh, he was just so helpful and so great, aside being just great looking. <laughs> I mean, I would have never thought that I would be there trying to install drywall. You did it. You wow. girls did it. Yay! Bye -bye. You guys did it. You cut your drywall, you fit it in, cut out your phone outlet. You know, I couldn't ask for a better assistant. Oh, thank you. <laughs> but I'm going to take it from here. All right, good. good. Okay. I'll see you. Thanks, Rib. You know, I have to tell you girls something. The most important thing about your home is to be master of your domain. And this right here is the master. Okay. Now, do you guys have a power drill? No. All right. <laughs> put the screw right on here, and we're going to lean into the stud. <laughs> See? And start right here on the line. Okay. You can make a mistake, it's okay. I'm not really good at this. If you just keep practicing, you'll get good at it. The power drills usually are a little scary and I don't know how to handle them, but it was really just nice to just use them. I'd never imagined that I would even do drywall. There's actually a little section of the wall. I actually did it myself. And I was so proud of it because it'll always be my wall. That's something just, that's going to remind me of the whole experience. And um, it's, it's really empowering. Then we had some fun with the painting. We picked this beautiful coral oh, color. I love this color. Yeah. Right, and with the ocean coming in and the color of her jewelry, I think it's just going to inspire her with you know creating beautiful, beautiful designs. Right. When you paint, it's really like getting to know one another. You have time to talk and you know you could just kind of stroke the walls but also you're changing the look and the feel of your room and it's happening before your eyes and look wow. i can that see like so the, just even the light coming in to really add a burst of color to any room the yeah. exercise too actually <laughs> for your arm i know i'm sweating right now <laughs> oh god <laughs> the next thing we have to do is we have to tape it and spackle all the holes in just pour a little bit of this into the bucket Right there, pour in some water, okay? Put it in there and turn it on. There you go. Get Ooh, all of it mixed fun. up. You don't want any it's dry like stuff. Cake. In there. It's like cream. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's enough of that. Let's put okay. this back in. Clean that up. And we'll head over here because this is going to set in five minutes. Okay. So we got to get okay. to work. Okay. So you take some plaster and you just mush it on the seam like this. Ooh. Use your wide knife to spread it out. Get a nice layer of it out and then you lay your paper over that okay. and then another layer of plaster. Okay. And then we're going to just put a layer on top, on top of it. Yeah. Okay. And that's okay. it. Okay. Yep. We had to spackle all the nail screws. So I think from there they were like, wow, this is really the foundation of my house. And I think they really 
made that transcend to this is the transformation of my life. Now we gotta let this dry. Let's go outside, we'll clean up our tools. Okay, All right. sounds good. Let's okay. go. I was just thinking of something. I wanna have a great surprise for Rubina. Something that she just gets so motivated and inspired. Every day she looks at it. Maybe something from her roots, like maybe her Afghan culture. I thought it was really sweet. She really took advantage of the fact that her really good friends were there to really give Rubina something very personalized um, and not just give her something that she thought was pretty, but to give something to Rubina with meaning. Well, I'm gonna think about it then. Awesome. <laughs> You know, there's all different types of flooring that you can buy, but we bought this type of bamboo flooring that actually snapped in. It was really easy to install. You just align the grooves and you snapped it, and you just needed a rubber mallet to kind of bang it into place. Get down on your knees. There you go. Okay. You hold one edge up like this, you start to feel it snap into place, and you just tap it. That could latch on. I've never done wood flooring. It always looks so complicated because how do you glue wood to the floor? But we started doing it and it was pretty simple. We just had to snap it together. Heather, you needed a short piece down there. You see I have two oh, long pieces no lined up. You either put a long piece or a short piece at the beginning of the row and then the rest of the row is all long pieces because you, you stagger the seams. So I don't think I understand. Wait, what do you mean? Sorry. So you put short pieces against the wall. You have a long piece, then the next one is a short piece. Oh. Got but it. you don't put short pieces in the middle right. of the floor. Don't let Rib do all the work. Uh -huh. I want. I want to see some muscle from oh. you, Rubina. We don't need men. Then I had Rib help Heather and Nagina put up the window treatments. So line it up with the holes that you marked. <laughs> I don't like this at all. <laughs> Once you use a power drill with your friends, it really brings a lot out of you that maybe you haven't seen before. We've learned so much about each other. I'm such a girl. Nikki and I just didn't want to use the power drill anymore. She wanted Rip to do everything. It's just like acting totally like a diva. No, this is hard. I don't like it at all. I called her on that. She was definitely up on that ladder in no time. Okay, guys, it looks fantastic. Coming up next, there's more than one surprise waiting for Abina in this room. Are you excited? Yes. How excited?